Alright. <clears throat> Hell yeah! Wait. Wait, we can fly the Thunderbolt? God damn it. No, that was the Thunderbolt too. Well, yeah, because the Thunderbolt was, uh, different. It was like a prop driven plane. <clears throat> I was born downtown, in our capital. That's nice. When I recall my homeland, my thoughts are filled with the sights and sounds of the city. But home means something different to each and every one of us. She Therefore, probably be early old enough to, to remember. Every place where our <clears throat> call home. Nah, she's like 60. Or she's a robot. All these people are robots. Maybe she's an airplane in disguise. If only. I don't know what the point of that scene was. Uh, <clears throat> isn't she rallying the troops? Everybody's maybe, like, oh, maybe it's I a lie that she's going around and actually visiting people. I don't know. And, and everybody's like, ah, she's so passionate about this war and ending it. Has significantly reduced the scale of Rouge's air defense network. Hell yeah. Wow. Ocean forces have moved into the areas where we gained air superiority and freed over half of the Yuzhin continent. Glad we we're a part of that. However, <clears throat> I, I'm I'm glad we just kind of skipped over that. I'm glad we got out of that. Base in the suburbs of Sierra Plata. For the past 72 hours, they've put their resources and people into action oh, and have already entered shit. the final stages of a launch. The missile silo is deep <clears throat> underground. To destroy it, we'll need a bomber to drop a huge deep penetration bomb in a precise place. <laughs> Unfortunately, yep. that airspace is thick with clouds at the moment, so it'll be difficult for a bomber to hit the target accurately. <clears throat> Normally, we'd wait for the weather to clear, with the situation being what it is, we don't have that option. So, we will be the bomber's eyes and find the missile silo. You'll all be equipped with targeting pods instead of special weapons. We need you to fly at low altitude, visually identify which silo they're activating, then acquire it with your targeting pod. <laughs> Once you press the firing switch, the bombers will drop their payload based on the location data provided by the targeting pod. So you don't fuck it up. The center of your sight until the bomb hits its target, or else it will miss entirely. It takes a high level of airmanship to properly guide these bombs to their targets while flying a plane. Naturally, we assume the enemy has positioned anti-air artillery and aircraft in the area of operations, so stay alert. Additionally, we suffered human and material losses in the last battle. The Cyclops Squadron will sit this one out. Trigger, it's up to you to make this work with just Strider Squadron. Cool. I don't even know who's on our team. Oh, fuck. I don't know who these people are. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> Operation Magic Spear. Hell yeah. You know what this calls for. Is, is this a good idea? Since you have to circle the uh, the silo and keep it in, in in viewing range, I probably do need something that's more maneuverable than the box. Like I mean, normally I you don't, the... but but you don't circle it. You just want to slow down enough uh, that the bomb will drop while you're just approaching. Like I mean, I know I'm the first guy to be like, "Yo, box," <laughs> but like, yeah, it's probably better if I use the F-15. And the F-22, I mean, fuck it. Nah, F-22's lame. So what's the, the MiG-21 business? BIS? I don't know what BIS actually stands for. It's an old... Oh, that thing's ugly as shit! Yeah, it's old. It's from, like, the 50s. It's old. It, is it super fast? No! <laughs> Look at that speed! It's crap! Yeah, no, it's crap. Hmm. Hmm. Um, now nah, I'll use the F-15. That'll be fun. I like the F-15 a lot. Does that repair? Yeah, that's the repair. Yeah, good enough. Strider Squadron, sortie ASAP. Nobody's even managed to shoot down the F-15. Like in real life? 
Yeah. It's mm. got like a 200 something to zero kill count. Mm. It's on the <clears> craziest <throat> kill streak of all time. So you're telling me it can, uh, the it has got a whole bunch of to to try throw our bombers off the scent. Kill streak bonus thing. Oh yeah, it's been, it's been run. It dropped the nuke like five times. Okay. Can't believe it still hasn't. Like, can't believe the battle's still going on though. Yeah, I know. Just keeps going. Must have been pretty on in, uh, inefficient nuke strikes. Maybe it's not using the good kill streaks. Maybe it's using the dogs. Keep the silo in line until the bomb hits. Yeah, I probably used all the bad ones. The enemy set up AT or weapons in multiple locations. Uh, I don't know. We need to work to kill streaks. What the fuck do they mean circle? Like, it doesn't... Oh, whatever. Alright, get me out of this. But no, the, the fucking F-15 is crazy. It's got, um... Uh, Keep the targeting pod train on that silo until the payload is delivered. Bunker Buster hits mark. Time for Hell fireworks. Yeah. Wait, I thought Khan was on Cyclops. I don't fucking know what he's doing. Why is he here? He's not. He was up there in the corner. Well, this is just... I don't know. Do we have unlimited bunker, bunker busters? Technically? Goodbye, AV-8B. I can't even fly you in this game. But would you want to? Technically, no. You guys do. Oh, Fuck. Oh. The count is here. I, I told you. I didn't, I didn't realize. Are they also dropping bunker busters? No. So they're just like, hey, you guys, you, you get to hang out. Yep. Hope not. That's pretty bad. No, that's not good. That's right behind me. Okay. Ran into the mountain. This song is going ham for what I'm doing right I, now. I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, this is a bit jaunty for not being the one to attack her. Ow. No, it wasn't. No, when he hit you, uh... He vibrated a little bit. Are you fucking kidding? It said destroyed. It's still a red circle behind you. I don't want to find out right now, but... Oh, you're gonna find out. Much to my dismay. Got it. Wow, that, that one might not be, though. That one also might not be. I'm just gonna it. Whoa! Stop shooting me! You're blowing up their bases. They're silent. No, 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 no. That's just gonna be off. Oh, it, 
It was a fake. Oh. A fake missile silo? Oh yeah, those are a real thing. Am I out running this missile? I mean, I guess this is the game where you were running a fake air base. Yeah. Yeah. Which eventually turned into a real air, air base. Kind of. We're launching planes from the world. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Must have been a decoy. Damn it. Alright, guys. Look, you're finding all their decoys. Oh, that's a little too close for my, my liking. Away too. No, the F-15 is fucking crazy. You can shear a, a wing off of it and it'll still fly. Seems unsafe. It's not great, but no other airplane can do that. That's. I was hitting the wrong buttons. No, I wasn't hitting the wrong buttons. I was getting thrown out of this wing. Don't get struck by lightning. I make mean, no guarantees of that. I mean, I know that you've tanked a lightning before. It's fine. But still. It's the worst. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, I assure you. Are you though? Are you really? That is very bad. The wind is so bad. <laughs> Fucking me up. So let's say theoretically you know where all the real ones are. The wind? Oh. So let's say theoretically you get really lucky and you only hit the real ones. Does the mission just end, or do you get to get all of them regardless? Uh, are you sorry? That was dangerous! Oh, I'm so glad that wasn't a real pole. Yeah, I know! Thank God that was a figment of my imagination. Although then again, if it sheared off your wing, you could still fly. Yeah, I know, totally. Oh shit, it's. Wait, well, no, it is on the other side. No, it's not on the other side of the mountain. Oh, So you've only got like one side of the destroyed, right? I don't know. Because you're running out of time. I know I am. Maybe they're just building more silos in the middle of this. That 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 guy's gonna sound better. Missile silo. Alert. We've detected an IRBM launch. Confirmed signature on our radar. Launch site is this dam. Way to sound silo? fucking. They certainly hit it well. We still have a chance. <laughs> launch site was this dam. Yeah, I'll get right on that. Uh, 
Of course it missed. Why would it not? I assure you, I am trying. Whoa! <laughs> I'm sure that's fine. Them? Behind the enemy. Is IRBM a real thing? I assume it's intermediate range ballistic vessel. Okay. So it's like I know, I know about the uh, IBMs. Well, ICBMs. Uh -oh. Intercontinental. Gotcha. Gotcha. But... The target will soon reach critical altitude. I I'm trying. Woo! That is, oh god, there's more. They fired a third one. And a fourth one. Life is pain. And the first one fired a third, uh, uh, a fifth one. What the fuck, what the fuck is it? I'd say it's around. It doesn't help me at all. It's somewhere. Yeah, that's nice. I don't have fucking time for this shit. Oh! Wow, it's really far down there, actually. Yeah, no, I I can. The IRBM has disappeared from radar. It's pointless to follow after it now. Remember when we shot down the arc bird at like 20, 30,000 feet? Yeah, but well, those were demons who did that. Ah, damn, you're right. Those weren't regular Joes. We still have a chance. And President Kills. Make twenty one. The Enemy fuck? Yeah, that looks good. That, that is fucking blinding. It's gonna be the uh, another launch. Take it out. The, uh, the thumbnail. It's not. <laughs> I would hope not, because there's nothing intelligible in that. I mean, if YouTube gives me the option. Although, it doesn't usually give me the option for something that's like all team Cool. Yeah, I noticed. That's nice. The target is about to reach critical altitude. I assure you, I am trying, and the airplane is not giving me what I need. Cool! The IRPM has disappeared from radar. It's pointless to follow after it now. Not from the silos? They certainly hit it well. We still have a chance. I really hope it's all two launches. I hope so too. Nicole, 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 Two. 
<laughs> Don't kill me. Bang, bang. That won't be enough. They hit me with four missiles. Bang, 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 bang. Accomplished. I mean, time stop. All the missiles are destroyed. destroyed. Hell yeah. Wait. I was cutting it pretty close. I was starting to get a little nervous. Quiet. These tails are freaking huge. Compared to like anything else that you fly, sure it's. You can do anything. I mean, he probably did a thing. He probably ate a missile. Eh. Arushi only has five IRB inside. It's a real good thing they don't have a like a Synfaxi. We have success. Well, that's why they have the arsenal. Yeah, but then, you know they could have both. Spider Squadron. Yeah. You did very well without like, your could, could you imagine? They have the arsenal bird and the missile operation. Seizing the capital. We'd blow them all up. It's not a big deal. And then, what if they got the uh, the, the, the satellite, the arc bird? What if they just got all the super weapons? <sighs> we can't have Stone Edge because it's already dead. Although, I mean, whatever. Um. With the loss of an arsenal bird, followed by the Honestly, Stonehenge was the most ridiculous out of all of them. Russia is running out of ways to counter. This is a great opportunity. Because it just Those covered most of the continent. Like you just couldn't, take down you couldn't fly an, an, an enemy plane anywhere near it. The special long-range strategy is entering its final phase. Our objective is to attack and capture the Erosian Air Force Base in Cape Rainey in northern Erosian. This important base is at the forefront of our strategy to establish control of Forbati. Under the cover of night, our plan is that all squadrons will invade from the valley to the south and mount an air assault on the area. Oh man, is this one of those trench runs? Oh yeah. As eyes on the skies above the valley, so your altitude will need to be restricted. If you go over a certain altitude, the enemy could spot you, ending the mission in failure. Keep that in mind. So, uh, don't do that. You are to take out the enemy's air defense forces as soon as possible and prepare for the support squad. When the air defense Tell me they don't have neutral, anything in that valley to, like... Marines. The plan is to take control of the base. Yeah, no, it's Anything's fucking the valley is only But they, they know the valley's there! Like, why would you not? Like, they don't just Fill have, it! Like, fill it with people and radar stations and anything! Maybe even just one guy with binoculars. Or just put an airplane in the sky with a big sea down radar and just be like, what the fuck is in that valley? I bet it's not friendly. <sighs> it's fine. It's a stupid trope. Plan, all right. It's pretty ugly. Um. Yep, that's a plane too. Yeah, I'm just, just two rolls. What is that? <laughs> That's the F-4 Phantom. I don't like it. One of the first missile airplanes. It looks like a banana. Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty chonky. Yeah, no, it, it, it just looks like a banana with wings. Ah, yeah, I can see it. This one's even worse, though. <laughs> look at, look at, look at this shit. Like, that's, that's not a wing. Put the tube up there. <laughs> Sir, we have a rocket and we put a person in it. 
How does it fly? Well, we have these pieces of scrap metal we stuck to the sides and something that's like a tail? I don't know what that is. That that came that, that, that came off of something else. But yeah. It's a rocket. Yeah, it's pretty gross. Yeah, no, that's bad. <laughs> um Oh, no, it's just got a little smiley face on it. Come on, a little, little grin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it kind of <laughs> does. Um, super Hornet. It's a big Hornet, kind of. I've never seen a Hornet that looks like that. Then again, whenever I see Hornets, I try to avoid them. So. Oh, well, alright. Shut up. <laughs> um... You know what? You know what? Maybe. You know, I, I thought the, the missile was the airplane for a second. I'm like, wow, that's a tiny <laughs> ass airplane. Yeah, don't you know? Every missile is like a mini airplane. You just put a person in it. That's how they hold it. Squadron, You're cleared to taxi. This is going to be a mistake. <laughs> Operational I werewolf. <laughs> I have to fucking well, because it happens at night. But I have to navigate a fucking ah uh, yes, werewolf. The only nocturnal creatures. It's fine. Everyone's seen a werewolf. Everyone. I mean, I I, I did watch uh, the Wolfman like two years ago, and I think there was a werewolf in Monster High. There might have been two monster eat the little fucks, man. There might have two werewolves in Monster High. Can, can, can you fly by me real quick? <laughs> I flew a little too fast. Wait, really? Did I fail it? I did fail it. Oh. Look, I've got fucking rockets on the end of this thing, so like... Well, why did you choose the fastest plane in existence? <laughs> fuck. 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 <laughs> fuck! What? What? <laughs> no, it wasn't! Ah, yeah, good enough! I remember in uh, Ace Combat 5, you could just zip to it, and it would automatically count it, but this one does not. No, this one's more realistic. Quote unquote. The fuck is that back thing? In oh, you're, oh, that's coming up. That weird, like, hot dog. I don't know. Why, why does your, why does your carrier have a hot dog coming out of it? Look, I don't know. Oh, boy. It'll be fine. Quote unquote fine. Oh, boy. Okay, so they got searchlights. So that implies that there's somebody monitoring this canyon. They yes. don't hear you? It's fine. Like, planes are loud, oh, right? they're fucking loud as hell. Like, they do all those sonic booms and whatnot? Well, that, that, they're not gonna go supersonic through a canyon. Yeah, but still. Oh god, kill me. Well, don't actually, but, like... I'm sure you'll die several times. You know, for a second there, I thought that said weapon pistol, and I was like, wow, you're just gonna... You're just gonna Hamilton this up? Hell yeah. That was his name, right? What? That was his name, right? Hamilton? Yeah, yeah! It fucking... It fucking shot me. I think I had, like, 99% damage, and he just, like, fucking peppered me, and I fucking died. Oh god. No, that's not gonna work. I'm... Mm. You know, I'm getting uh, Twilight Princess flashbacks. Yeah, I know. I'm waiting for the fart trumpets. 
saying that in this airplane is like a bad joke, but it's fine. You pass waypoint three. You're coming up on the base, imposing radio silence. We won't be able to talk again until you're over the base. Continue to keep an eye on your altitude. There are plenty of dark spots that can sneak up on you. I think you just got caught. Oh, wow. Yep. They should have seen you there, though. Nah, that's fine. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mm, I'm done. I think we're done. Yep. One crashed. Yeah, let's choose a different plane. Yeah, I wondered why you picked this one. And, I was like, I'll maybe just not to the end. And then I'm like, uh... So, not that. Um, what else carries lasers? The F-15E does? No. I was... Oh. You don't want to fly the same plane twice in a row. Mm, I look like I have better options, though. Use a railgun. That sounds like not a great idea. Yeah, it's actually pretty poor. Um... I mean, to be honest, it all looks like the same shit to me, so it doesn't matter. I know, but like... It's all plain to me. This plane looks like a leaf. You've been seeing some fucked up leaves. <laughs> uh, you've seen an oak leaf. Kind of like it. Beginning nighttime aerial refueling process. Be careful of reduced visibility. Oh, I'm blind. Oh, where do I go? I shouldn't crash into the tanker. <laughs> that would be stupid. Cool. I'm glad they gave you permission. Oh, well, it's kind of important. Is it? Kind of. You don't. You don't think you can just like grab a plane? Ah! And You don't think you can just grab a plane and just like Excellent. find a refueling plane and just like like latch onto it? No, I. You don't think that's like you, you don't think that's legal? No, I'm pretty sure. I, I would assume that like every fucking um, thing has like proprietary nozzles, so like you can't just like. Oh, so if I took my biplane up there, I couldn't like refuel up here. Well, you could, you could probably refuel your biplane with like a gas tank and just send someone out on the wing. Like, do you think that'd be reasonable? There were large uh, biplanes with like multiple engines where engineers would actually go out and service the engines while it was in flight. Like, they'd walk out on the wings. So that was real. That sounds horrifying. You yeah. never catch me doing that. Yeah, only in Russia. 
Of course it was the fucking <laughs> Of course. <laughs> Let me guess, they were also bears. No, they were not bears. <laughs> the engineers were bears on unicycles. No, that would be complete insanity. <laughs> No, but that would make it pretty good. You know, it would make an entire, uh, an air fleet of bears. I mean, somebody did a Bear Force 1, but I don't know if that was... I think that was bears taking over the Air Force? Mm. I remember being on the, uh... You remember when the, the 3DS did, like, videos? Like, you remember that app? Not really. Oh, uh, well, they, they had a special app where every, like, every time Nintendo remembered it existed, they would send out, like, a special video. Oh. And it was usually, like, two minutes long. But the only things I remember were, like, uh, Dinosaur Office. And it was just dinosaurs in the office. Cool. And, uh, I remember Bear Force 1. I don't remember what it was about, though. <laughs> Yeah, and everything will go boot peachy after that. I'm sure it'll be fine. What could possibly go wrong? How do you say that? Well, I'm here just chatting to myself. I just had my radio turned off. I mean, you're definitely not as chatty as, uh... As Blaze? I think that's what his name was. Blaze was the one for me, Ace Combat 5. Yeah, he, he was pretty chatty. He could say yes and no. Yeah, I know, it was crazy. I remember him being kind of like a sarcastic asshole. Great. Only time I ever did that, to be honest. Like, I always gave, like, unironic answers. And it was, like, really funny to be able to fuck with people. Oh, God! Hey, you spotted. Cool! Ma Into the wall we go! Ma maybe you should have picked a better uh, color scheme for your plane. Damn. Should have put that rock camouflage on. Ah, you're right. Or a Bigfoot suit. What checkpoint? Yeah, that's what I thought. No weapons until you reach the enemy base. All aircraft reduced. Nice job. Woo! Well, <laughs> a little delayed there. It's fine. Well, he couldn't interrupt the guy. Like the like, the guy who had, had to reprimand you. No weapons until you reach the enemy base. All aircraft reduce altitude. We have altitude restrictions from here on out. Should have picked the helicopter. Instead. Only in, uh, only in Assault Horizon, and those missions are apparently awful. Although you can bounce off buildings, like, they don't do damage to you. I mean, that, that, that's just normal helicopter procedure. Yeah. No, totally. See, he, most people think that helicopters are propelled by, you know, the, the, the blades? Mm -hmm. No, no, that's just for steering. They, they, they bounce off things. <laughs> They're made of rubber. Yeah, and then that's how they get around. It's just, it's really hard to animate that in, in, in movies and in shows. Mm. So, so like Superman, they're just like, well, they fly, they they hover, mm. but in reality, they're they're just always bouncing off of something. They're using a whole bunch of momentum. Damn. Strider one, you've passed through waypoint two. The valley's about to get narrower. Be careful. Yeah, I'll try. No. When can we take on the final mission? I'm starting to get tired of all this. Oh man, they've put my thoughts into this game. <laughs> Wait, we get the freaking guns. We're going to need all of you in Farbanti. Without Wiseman here, everybody wants to give orders like they're the company commander himself. And the best thing about Strider Squadron is our leader keeps his mouth shut.
Oh boy. Oh, good. They stopped. Watch your speed. This is fucking ridiculous, by the way. This is like Grand Canyon levels of like. You pass waypoint three. You're coming up on the base. Imposing radio silence. We won't be able to talk again until you're over the base. Continue to keep an eye on your altitude. There are plenty of dark spots that can sneak up on you. See, this is where you pull out the landing gear and just like <laughs> roll off. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, maybe. Are we done yet? Well, you gotta get past this turn, this hairpin turn. Help! No, 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 no! Oh, we're fucked. Oh boy! <laughs> Strider one, you have passed through waypoint one. No weapons until you reach the enemy base. All aircraft reduce altitude. We have altitude restrictions. So you call it handgun? Does that count? Problem. Keep altitude below 600 meters. Good. Maintain your current course. Searchlight up ahead. Watch for it. Yeah, we should have just sent in a whole bunch of boats instead Stay of out of their sight. That would have been smarter. Strider, but we're playing the plane game, so like, it's got to be the We should have sent in the submarines. Those are the airplanes that we see. Sure. They move in three dimensions. Sure. Not very well. But they can go up, they can go down. Yeah, but like... Hold down. Let's say you're getting a little, one, getting a little high there. It's fine. The valley's about to get narrower. Be careful. Oh, totally not nice. oh, like, hit the fucking afterburners. Well, you've been here at least four times. You should know this by now. Look, I'm not memorizing any of this crap. Why are you not memorizing the layout of this, this very remarkable canyon? This is the last step, Count. We'll take the enemy base and use it as a bridgehead. Watch yourselves out there. We're going to need all of you in Farbanti. Without Wiseman here, everybody wants to give orders like they're the company commander himself. And the best thing about Strider Squadron is that our leader keeps his mouth shut. Well, that's how I atone for my sins. Watch your speed. Yeah, shut up. You know, I miss. I, I wish. Uh, I wish Grim was here. Cause he could be like, "Wow, this is insane! How are you doing this?" <laughs> he was really impressed by the slightest things. It was way easier to like make jokes, cause the commentary was just obnoxious. But but now everyone's like got like competent voice acting, and it's like, yeah, this isn't as fun. Oh, the flying fuck! I'm gonna avoid that. Like that. Okay. Now just somehow slow down because there's like two hairpin turns here. Yeah. Yeah, we're about at stall speed. Are we done yet? No. No, we're not. I don't know, but all those turns make me sick. I'm not liking that. It's fine, just thread the needle a million times. Yeah. Shut up. Visual confirmation on the airbase. Reach destination. Commence the attack. It's time for their wake up call. The longer it takes, the worse off will be. Hurry up, finish them off. Let's keep the beating. Target acquired. Is that a B fifty two? Sure. Like, there's like two below. What the fuck? Where the hell did they come from? 
Isn't the B-52 like really fucking old? Oh yeah, it's ancient. Like World War II or something like that? No. Uh... I don't actually know. I think it's from the 50s or 60s. Okay. So the only thing I really know about the B-52 is that there's an Atari game, and it's one of the few games where that had voice, quote-unquote, acting for it. Ha. Huh. Because it, it was, uh, you could hook it up to a voice synthesizer. And it would read the name, and it was like, B-52 Bomber! <laughs> Thirty assassin treats now. Jeez, they're working real fast. Yeah, that's crazy. This one's even on the Wii U. Crazy. I mean, I, I don't understand that one. Like, that seems like a bad plan to put an exclusive Assassin's Creed on the Wii U. Like, I mean, dumber things have been done. Yeah. Yeah. Man, that's probably gonna fail me the fucking mission. I don't want to chase after that. There's Watch it. Enemy has a block on you. The timing couldn't be worse. This puts our delivery staff in danger. Again, there's all this ocean. Could we have not done... No, we don't believe in boats. Clearly not. Boats aren't even real. Look, ever since the Sinfaxing, we've sworn off boats. Boats are the enemy. That's why we built giant planes. That shoot up more planes. It's all about planes. Look, the last war taught us... If the last war taught us anything, is that planes beat everything. I mean... Oh, yep. Basilisk? I didn't mean it. Visual confirmation on the airbase. Reach destination. It's nice that they don't tell you what exactly will hinder the mission. I mean, kind of did? Yeah! Got it that time. So this is the wake-up call. This is what you wanted, right? Well, yes, but... You wanted the enemies to know that you were here. Well, they were gonna have to know at some point anyway. I saw the missile alert come up and I'm like, ah, shit, did you just fail? <laughs> Come on. Oh, 
Pizza guy. Yeah, I would have said you gotta deliver the pizza soon, otherwise it's loot. <laughs> Why are we making these references? Uh, I don't know, that's just what he said. Uh, and then and then Count Chocolate was all like your jokes aren't fu very funny. Hamburgers? And then it was just all just a real big whisper thing. They really, they really were delivering pizzas. Damn it. Who keeps a bunch of guns at their front door? Oh, well, I guess if we're in the American South. I was gonna say! <laughs> I, I read somebody's review like, hey, please do not deliver packages at 4.30 in the morning. I almost shot your delivery guy. Oh, and I'm just like, what? <laughs> Speaking of, somebody delivered stuff at, at, to my house at 4.30 in the morning. Oh, boy. And I only knew that they were out there because they had some, uh, they had some powerful subwoofers. Mm. What? What did I miss? So everything's dead now. Oh, oh no, the gunboats are here. <laughs> Damn it. Great. Ha! Got it. Got it for you, dude. Fuck it. You don't say. I love this with Sparta. Or Bagel Island. Fuck, I, I forgot already. Uh, Rainy King? Oh, oh no. that's a worse. <laughs> that's a worse name. Uh. Oh, these guys are actually tryhards. Oh no. Some try hard against a fucking laser. And he goes in the clouds. I'm trying. Wait, what? Where do you come from? Oh, uh, underground. Hey, they borrowed out. Damn it. No. Hi. Oh, I blew up one plane. That's nice. There's helicopters? They come from the sky. No, they didn't come from the sky. No, that's how helicopters spawn. The clouds all get together, and then once the clouds are dense enough, <laughs> a helicopter appears. And then they fall and they bounce off the ground. And that's just how they get around. Yes. Yeah. yeah. All this helicopter lore. Yeah, for a game that doesn't even like let you fly a helicopter. Yeah, no. I'll have to I'll have to dig one up. Helicopter. I mean, I got I think I got chopped at dirt. That'd be fine. Would it? No, <laughs> no one. Yeah, that's gonna be fine. No, I'll, I'll, I'll go to the store and I'll buy fire. What? <laughs> it's a helicopter game. Okay. It, it's a game that always catches my attention because I'm like, ah, Fireblade, that sounds really cool. And I pull out, I'm like, ah, goddamn, it's a helicopter game again. Nah, I'm sure we'll be fine. Contact! Two o'clock! Go! Go! Fire! Yeah, I'm gonna fly out of the game. Fire! Turn down that barricade! I'm running away! I would be!
and <laughs> nobody wants to respond. Here's your pizza. <laughs> you killed everyone! <laughs> Extra spicy. <laughs> it's to die for. <laughs> well, at least I won't have to share. There will be no leftovers. Wait, are we gonna land here? I mean, I would assume so. We got pizza. I think we got a to do. Is it touch grass again? <laughs> <laughs> this is the most realistic one where it's like, yeah, there's landmines out there. <laughs> Yes, and they're frozen in time. Why are there helicopters here? Oh, they're 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 the ones that are carrying all the people. Oh. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. Uh those are powerful landmines. Yeah. Alright. Try again. That other universe they're partying without me. Alright, let's be to the share. I wonder if you could fly into one of those helicopters. You probably could, but it, it takes something. Well, actually, you might just go straight through them. It really depends. What? No. Stay away. Strider one. You have passed. Well, that was a lot of fun. Was it? No. Yeah. That's what no. It was. That 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 trench run. Excellent. It was a bad time. Submarines have arrived from the Ocean mainland and are refueling. Oh hey, the submarines showed up. Will serve as a frontline platform for a mission to take Farbanti. We are almost at the end of this operation. No, we're not. There's still six missions to go. That's close enough. Alright, we'll see you guys later.